Hi everybody, it's me Angie. I'm back. How are you all doing today? I promise I'd come back and do the box. Um, unfortunately, I did film the box, the decorating of the box, and um, it went all a bit wrong because the phone was in the holder and I'd actually, where I attached it, um, it blocked the microphone so you could see everything I'd done but you couldn't hear anything so I'm gonna I've had to re rethink it so I have a box here that I've done exactly the same to except I didn't paint it um, and see it's still purple inside and um, what I've done I've already inked this around the edges but I'll do a bit more just to show you how I, how I do the process so I'll just get some ink Right, so I have with this I distressed inked it with uh, Victorian velvet. Let me get a little spongy thing. And basically, a bit like when I did the book, just go around the edges like that, like that. This is I put a little bit on, but I'm I'm not finished it, so I thought I'd finish it with you. So it's the same book, same memo pad, same paper, just um just didn't come out well you could you couldn't hear what I was saying which is not not good for me so anyway so just distress it around the edges with the ink yeah. and then we're gonna what we're gonna do is we put gonna put some flowers on the box just to decorate it up make it nice and pretty pretty around the edges just distress it a bit, that's all. Like that. So put my glue gun on. I'm going to find some flowers. So there it is there. It's just distressed a bit more. Hope you can see this. I'm hoping this time it turns out for me. I just feel like sometimes I... Like, um, I don't know. Not not a walking disaster area, but just things don't never turn out how they should. So flowers, that's the one. I've got some pink flowers. These ones are nice. These go nice on the box. So we're going to use these because I've already decorated once. I know sort of basically what what I did last time. I'm going to do it again. Well, I'll replicate it as much as possible. So we need these. These ones are nice. They go with it really nice. Um, where's the box? One I've already done. So while we're waiting for the glue gun to mm, heat up, because I should have done that before I even started filming. Uh, Right then. We just need a couple of flowers like last time when we did the book. What have we got on there? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Where are the other one? See, that's too bright. Or too yellow. It's like Goldilocks and the Free Bears. So we've got some pink flowers. Now we need some little buds and green flowers. And I'm going to put um, a, what have I done with that? A bead on it. I did get a bead out. Put on it. Oh my god, here we go again. that bead that one so that's going to go on there because it's nice it's shiny and it's pink it'll go yeah so we just got to wait for the glue gun and some green flowers as well so we're going to use some of these as fillers these ones they're really nice as well so how have you been today then what have you been up to I haven't done a lot today, getting ready for the party. 
I've changed my outfit now because when my um my pirate lady pirate one came it was too small I just I look ridiculous in it so now I'm going to be a Spanish senorita 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 it's really sweet a lady came in the shop today and brought me some um, junk jewellery um give me a bag for you as well I don't know what I've done with that yeah really nice look I can break all that down use it in flowers or on projects it's really nice so it's um a necklace but I'll just I'll break it all apart I bet it's broke already and then she bought me this one it's all tangled up hey red beads really nice this one's got a little blue stone on it there so what is that oh I don't know what that is just a love art that's a headband that I got from Primark for a pound. And look how many's on there. Flower centers. One, two, three, four, five, six. Really pretty ones as well. Yeah. And she gave me this as well. It's like a, a, a choker. What you put around your neck, in it, obviously. Yeah, it's all, all sparkly demontes. So that was nice of her. Ooh, and look what come today. I got a die. AliExpress, it's a fairy. I can't wait to do that one. Cut it out. It's really, really pretty. She stood on her tippy toes. So yeah, and also today came my bag of um, stuff from Jenny 644. She was selling off a bag of 60 appliques and um, doilies, little doilies and appliques, a whole bag full um, in her sale. I think they were I think they were ten pound. There's loads in there. Look, loads, tons and tons. So I should be used, putting them to good use. Yeah, happy with that. In fact, I might even put one on the box. Should I put one on the box? Let's have a look. Let's see what we got. Let's see, do we? Hmm, that one. That's quite nice. It's a bit white there. Brown. It's pretty in it. Did you put that on? Let's have a look. There's another one the same. So we need some of sort of brownish, don't we? No, I don't like that. Let's have a look. It's too big. I think we found it. We'll put that one on. Yeah, I like that. Me likes that. Me like it. He likes it. as well yeah stick with that so hopefully it should be heat, heated up now enough to use that yes it is so let's just check we still going got it in there okay so i want this to show a little bit so i'm gonna i'm gonna move it down a little bit and work around it so with the flowers i always take the plastic bit off the back that bit, that bit, what's the biggest one, that one, and that bit. Let's stick that on. I just love um, watching it grow. It's just something, it's it's unique isn't it it's nobody else would have, have thought of doing it and they wouldn't have done it in this paper like that. okay it's growing already i need to leave enough out so you can see the doily maybe i'll put that on top Well, it's coming apart. Let's stick that bit in. This box is going to be a gift. It's a gift for um, my daughter phoned me and said that she's got one of her. She's a carer and she looks after these um, old people. 
what I'm going to be one of soon. But she's a really, really, really kind, caring person, my, my daughter Nicola. And she's a, she looks after, she does care, she looks after um, elderly people, goes into their homes and looks after them. And one of her ladies is her birth going to be a birthday, and she said, would, would you, would I, the box that I was covering, she watched the first part, and she said, would I make one like that for her lady? And I said, well, when I've done this one, you can have it. So she's going to give it to her one of her little little ladies for um, her birthday. So I can put some fillers in there. Any green bits. Yeah, I like that. That's really nice, doesn't it? I think it's a bit easier because I've already done it once, so I'm just not, it's not completely, not going to be exactly the same, but it's the same sort of flowers I'm using. I'll get in. Uh, yeah, looking forward to the weekend again. Can't wait. Saturday is going to be Friday's going to be hectic because Friday I've got when I come in from work I finish at one, and then I got to make the the curry and the chili, the big pots of them. So I got to get that done, and then Saturday's going to be manic, and then hopefully by the time the party starts at seven, it'll all be done. Well, it should be. If it ain't done, then it ain't getting done. And uh, I can just relax then. And then Sunday, we're going to have hangovers, I think. Depending on what everybody drinks. Yeah, just growing from there, look. Pretty. Have a bit in there. I, I've not really seen anybody else do this. I mean, they obviously have because YouTube is a massive thing. But I've not personally seen anybody decorate like I do. So I've not copied it off anyone. Put it that way. I didn't like that. Things are hard to pull off. That one's not coming off. Go back. Yeah, there we go. Try it there. Put that in. Right then. Try that one. Just feel like it needs more. No, that don't look nice. Blob of glue. I'm going to come back and I'm going to make some more flowers, but I'm going to make the ones, the next one, the tutorial I'm going to do is I'm going to make these flowers here with uh, Tim Holtz tarred florals. And um, yeah, you can make them out of coloured cards. You can, I think I actually painted these red and then I sprayed them with some glittery stuff, spray stuff to make them sparkle and put a, put a gem in the middle. But yeah, they're nice. They're really nice and look nice on cards. Look nice on books as well. That effective, isn't it? Look at that. Nice. Yeah. So my next tutorial is gonna be making some more flowers because the last one, my last attempt at it, didn't come out as good as what I'd like to have. Not too big. Yeah. I'm 
one's even bigger. No. So yeah. What else we've got now? Got the beet. It's gonna go in there. Should put over here. So yeah, you can just put any anything you want, anything of interest, a gem, a bead, um, anything really that looks nice, that looks unusual. And people sort of look and think, oh, what's that? What's that on there? So yeah, that's all it takes really, is a couple of flowers. So there, I think I'm going to leave it like that. Now I'm going to put some sparklers in and some little gems, if I can find the gems. I don't know what I've done with them. Again. No, that's not it. Aha, there's a gem. So these are just like little crystals on a, on a stem. They're really nice. See them? See them, see them, see them. Just make it a bit more interesting. Where are we going to put you? In there. So like I said, fold it over, bend it over a bit, like that, so that you've got like a little platform then. Let's put the glue on. You just Rather than it, just make it like a little platform. I don't know where was I putting that. Is it there? Oh, I can't remember now. I don't think it was there. Might have been there. A bit more glue. So yeah. So we've got a crystal, we've got a bead. We need some sparklers. We bling in the box. Bling, bling, bling. Bling, bling, bling. I've ordered some more of these off AliExpress. They're so sparkly. Look how sparkly. I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but they are really sparkly. But I've ordered some different shaped ones as well. They're not, so they have a little bit, something different, because it all seems to be the same, doesn't it? Where should I put it there? Yeah, put it there. It's just poking out. There we are. That's nice. It don't it really don't take a lot. It's it's minimal and but it's really effective so we've got a little doily on there we've got uh, four little flowers a couple of fillers a little couple of rosebuds a bead a crystal and the and the bling 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 and that's your box virtually done i'm going to put some braid on it i don't want to put anything all around the edge because it's too uniform you can just do it wherever you want it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put a bit of braid down here. So I've just got to get some braid. Bear with me. I've got to find it now. There it is. So I've got this braid, which is really nice. I got it at a car boot sale. A lady was, she had a couple of bits like buttons and stuff. And uh, I was looking at them and she said, oh, she said, my, my, my auntie, she's had a shop in, I don't know, up north somewhere an abadashery shop she said and she obviously she passed away or she shut it down or whatever she said i've got a load of lace in the back of, in the boot of my car i was like oh let me have a look let me have a look so i ended up buying i had tons and tons of all these trims some of it was a bit 
manky. Some of it was a bit smelly, some of it was old, but the majority of it was really nice. So yeah, I'm going to put that like that. The majority of it was really nice, um, and I got the whole lot, I think, for... She gave me some, something like fiver. Couldn't believe that. Couldn't believe that. Yeah, so I was lucky there. I love car boot cells. It's absolutely peeing down with rain. This weather wants to make its mind up. We've actually gone out and bought a, a party tent for the weekend because it's not, nothing worse than it being peeing down and you, everybody's stuck in the house. I want to be able to use the garden because it's massive and the conservatory at my sister's house. So I bought a party tent. And it's six metres by four, I think, something like that. So it'll um, we'll be able to go outside as well. So yeah, I put a bit of braid around there. You could do whatever you, I mean, I could have put pearls around it. I just like this. I just think, I, I think it looks really effective. And then bring this round a little bit underneath. Dithers. Oh, and I did, I stuck a gem on there on the inside, so it's just some a little bit of interest as you open it up. There, trim this off. There it is. Simple as that. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Put the pad back in. Let you get it in. There we have it. What do you reckon? Nice, isn't it? I like it. Yeah, it was, that was easy. That was really easy. And that's like as simple and easy as it is. It's just like um, doesn't it, it doesn't have to be complicated, and it doesn't have to be you know, loads and loads and loads of stuff chucked on it. And I will show you the other box what I did. This is the one I did the tutorial on that um, didn't come out, and this is the one I just did. So they're they're similar. They are similar. I got the bead there on that one. I haven't got the two rosebuds there, but every every single box that you do, even though if you use the same things, it won't look the same. So there they are, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you like watching that, and uh, I'll be back soon. I'm going to do another tutorial and make some more flowers. Uh, that doesn't look nice on there. Nah. Yeah, and then... Um, Maybe a bit longer next time. I don't know what to do next. I'll do some flowers and then um, maybe we create something together. Because I I like to do it spontaneously. I don't, you know, like I said, oh, but I'm I'm going to get really organised and everything. Then I just feel like uh, it's robotic and I like to do it as create as I'm going along because that's how I create. I when I'm doing a project, I think well, I'm going to cover something. And it just develops into something rather than having it all beforehand, if you know what I mean, if you get my gist. So I'm going to, I want to do it, I want to just do it cold, as in find the stuff. You can listen to me bashing and crashing around, you're used to that, because I'm really unorganised anyway. So um, I hope you like watching that. I know it's a bit, it was a bit quick. Um, and I'll come back to you. And we'll do a nice long tutorial where I do, I'll show you how I do my flowers properly because that other one was rubbish as well. I'm not very good, am I? Never mind. You don't get paid any anything for it. And I like doing it and I hope you like watching it. So I'll speak to you later, folks. Bye for now. Bye.